Now you're gonna love Rotenberg as much as you love pretzels, hot dogs, beer, and cuckoo clocks. If you don't like those, don't go to Rotenberg. But who doesn't love those? Rotenberg has been around for 850 years and it looks like it's brand new. It has survived the bubonic plague, the 30 year war, which lasted 30 years. It has been untouched and they've been celebrating Christmas, believe it or not, 500 years. All your Christmas memories, you're gonna relive every one of them when you're in Germany, especially Rotenberg, because they have preserved that town for the ages. It's kind of fun when you're going through the Christmas market in Rotenburg and you see the cuckoo clock. I don't know what your background is, but for me, when I was a child, we grew up with a, uh, an authentic cuckoo clock. Now, we didn't have a lot of money, so I know, looking back, that my dad spent a lot of money to get that clock. And it's interesting because now as I'm older, when I walked into that place and I saw the cuckoo clock, my childhood just came alive. And that little bird came out and made that cuckoo sound, and all of a sudden, boom, I was back to being a kid in Idaho and I was peeling potatoes and shelling peas and, and husking corn and I'm like, wow, that sound is so powerful. So cuckoo, I'm just like, it means, oh, it's almost lunchtime. Or cuckoo, we're gonna go to bed in a while. That's amazing that a place uh, in Germany that specializes in something could make it all the way to a farm in Idaho and be a memory for a kid. I hope there's some things in this piece that uh, you look at and you go, yeah, I remember when I was there and I saw that and I thought it was really, really cool. I'm glad it's in there. That's my goal. Hey Siri, how do you say goodbye in German? In German, goodbye is Auf Wiedersehen. Auf Wiedersehen. Auf Wiedersehen. Auf Wiedersehen. Auf Wiedersehen. Auf Wiedersehen. Auf Wiedersehen.